Angela from the blog AngelaMarieMade.com. Today I'm going to show you how to build a DIY desk organizer. We have been working on getting our office organized and a desk organizer was the perfect solution for some loose items and notebooks that I had on my desk. This wooden desk organizer is classic, chic, and modern, and I love that it can be used as a DIY charging station as well if you want to for your phone. I think it looks beautiful on our new DIY desk that I built a few weeks ago as well. To jazz up our desk organizer, I added cute brass corner brackets, and I think they add that extra charm and really elevate the look of it. I will link the corner brackets I used below in the description box. And also you can get a full material list, cut list, and tutorial linked below as well. Okay, let's get started with this desk organizer. Step one is to make the lumber cuts for the desk organizer. Use a miter saw and cut the one by four board. You're going to cut one piece at 11 and a half inches and one piece at two inches. For the one by three, you'll just need one piece at 11 and a half inches. For the one by six boards, you need to make special angled cuts. Begin by marking a half inch in from the bottom right edge of the 1x6 board and mark with a pencil. Then mark 3 inches from the top right edge. Use a straight edge to draw a line from the half inch mark to the 3 inch mark. The angle we just drew was about 31 degrees. Set your miter saw to a 31 degree angle and cut along the angled line. Then cut a straight 90 degree cut 6 inches from the bottom right straight edge where you marked the half inch mark. And this completes your first side piece of the desk organizer. Repeat these steps again for the second side piece. Lastly, cut two more one by six boards at 11 and a half inches with straight 90 degree cuts. Now all of your board cuts are finished. If you want to also use this desk as a charging station, now is a good time to drill the hole. I decided to skip this step, but if you want to do this, I would drill the holes towards the bottom long edge of one of the 1x6s at 11.5 inches and the 1x4 board at 11.5 inches. This way they'll be hidden since they're towards the bottom of the boards. You can stain or paint the desk organizer. I chose to do a black paint. I used some paint I had on hand already. It was Tricorn Black by Sherwin-Williams. I love how the black paint finish looks on top of our stained DIY wood desk top that we built previously. And I just think the combo of the wood and the black is just beautiful together. If you're painting as well, apply one coat of primer to the boards and let it dry. Then apply two coats of paint and let it dry between each coat. Make sure to prime and paint both sides and edges of all the pieces that are going to show. This includes all of the boards except for one of the 1x6 boards at 11 and a half inches since the back side of it won't be showing since it's going to sit on the top of the desk. Step four is to assemble the base frame of the desk organizer. Begin by clamping one of the 1x6 boards at 11 and a half inches to your work surface edge. Then use a brad nailer with one inch nails and wood glue to attach the second 1x6 board to create the back of the desk organizer. Next, attach the front 1x3 board using wood glue again and one inch brad nails and a brad nailer. Use clamps to hold the board in place while nailing. And make sure to wipe away any excess wood glue immediately with a damp rag or paper towel so that it doesn't dry on your desk organizer. Step five is to attach the middle one by four board and divider. Measure three inches from the side where you want to place your two inch divider and mark the back board with a pencil or chalk. Apply wood glue to three sides of the two inch divider and line it up with the mark you just made and set it in place. Once the divider is set in place, use wood glue along the bottom side of the 1x4 at 11 and a half inches and place it on the bottom board and push it up tight to the divider piece as seen here in the video. Use a measuring tape to make sure that the middle piece is the same distance away from the back board on each side. Place a clamp on each side of the middle board and let the glue set for about an hour to dry. Again, wipe away any excess glue. Step six is to attach the angled sideboards. Attach one of the 1x6 angled sideboards to the side of the desk organizer. 
using wood glue and one inch nails. Repeat this step on the other side. Step seven is to add corner brackets to your desk organizer if you prefer. You can add the corner brackets using the nails provided with them and a hammer. It helps to first poke a small screwdriver into the nail hole to make a little groove to get the nail started. Finally, fill your nail holes in with wood filler or a lightweight spackle and do any necessary paint touch-ups. And now it's time to enjoy your new desk organizer and get organized. I'm so happy with how our new desk organizer turned out and it's been great having everything organized on top of my desk. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below, and if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up as well. Thank you again for stopping by, and please subscribe to my channel for more DIY and decor videos.